What is up, man? NFL 25 Gamers. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today's video, we are talking about the nickel strong defense and a blitz that I really like to run out of it. And uh, the play we like to use for this blitz is the corner crash three. And this is kind of a complimentary version to our zone blitz and stuff like that that you can find on the channel. Uh, but what we like to do with this is we like to base a line. We like to shift our linebackers to the right. Uh, we then want to go ahead and crash our defensive line down. And then what we like to do is we like to take uh, Geno Atkins here. We like to man him up on the running back. We like to then take uh, Still here. We like to place him in a man up on the um, slot receiver on the right side of the screen or the tight end. And if there's neither of those, then we like to put him in a quarterback spy. Um, and then the defensive end, we like to place him into a flat zone. And uh, one other adjustment here, we like to shade our coverage to the left. And uh, also, real quick, if you have time to get this off, we'll put that uh, backer on the right in a hook zone. You don't have to do that if you don't want to. Another thing that you can do to make this a little quicker is globally blitz, globally zone both linebackers, then man align, base align. And if you have the, the speed on the stick to do that, uh, that just makes the zones play a little bit better. Uh, but as you see, this blitz is going to send uh, pressure at the quarterback. We're only going to be sending three guys. And uh, typically, we'll get that edge pressure. Uh, one thing that your opponent might be able to do, though, is he may be able to stop the edge pressure uh, by slide protecting his line to the right side of the field. Um, and if he does that, this is why we like to uh, send that corner. Because if they, for some chance, pick him up, then that corner's coming off. And as you see, we still get the pressure uh, from that guy. So uh, just a, a couple things here. If you want to get two-way heat, all you have to do is globally blitz both your linebackers straight down. And... Um, Another thing you can do is you can take these this safety, maybe put him in the hook zone, play a little inverted cover two. And another thing you could do, you could even zone off uh, this uh, corner on the left side because he's no longer needed. And as you see, we should get double edge pressure at the quarterback, sending seven. So it's not any uh, crazy thing, but it is something that you can use uh, to get some pressure. But we really like to base our defense off that three-man edge rush uh, off that right side of the field or excuse me, off that left side of the field. Uh, so that's all we've got for the play of the day. Real quick, I want to run through that one more time just in case you missed it. Uh, so we want to come out. We want to shift our linebackers to the right, crash our line down, globally blitz our linebackers, globally zone our linebackers, man up the defensive tackle on the running back, man up the left of, or excuse me, the right of screen defensive tackle on the slot receiver or tight end, place the defensive end on the right in a flat zone and then we like to man align and then base align and as you see our play is now set up and we're going to try to get that pressure off that left side and uh, that time we got picked up for the first time and that's kind of what happens in practice but if you keep running the same blitz uh, you will get picked up after a while and then if you guys can't handle that setup then we like to show you this um, all you have to do is base align shift your linebackers to the right crash your defensive line down and you're good here and you should be able to get that pressure from this uh, look here um, but what we like to say we like to suggest to you those hot routes on a line uh, so that you can get a little better coverage out of this play um, those couple of hot rod adjustments uh, really make this play pretty tough to to, uh, to look out for so uh, anywho guys that's our play of the day that's our blitz uh, and then we're gonna have some different formations here I know I'm really big on the nickel strong it's, it's probably the best way to get pressure Overall, in Madden 25, thanks to S. Gibbs from PrimaMadden.com for finding out how good the Nickel Strong is. Uh, but anywho, guys, you can check out our other Nickel Strong videos on my YouTube channel. Uh, but that's all we've got for our play of the day. Just something simple. Uh, if you guys could give me some feedback, do you like the play of the days? Should I keep them going? If you don't like the play of the days, uh, we will change them and we will have something else for you. So, anyways, guys, thanks a lot for your time, and we'll see you later.